What's up guys, it's Monday. Uh, it's a busy day today because I'm updating that website that I was talking about uh, with the prints or whatever because people have been asking about it. And also I'm gonna do some sort of Sonic piece. I'm not sure exactly what yet. I'm gonna go on Google with you guys, check out some pictures and then decide from there what I'm gonna work on. And yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna kinda customize him and make him or the characters I use from Sonic if I use more than one. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna like change them up or give them hats or like clothing or anything, I'm not really sure yet, or if I'm just gonna like do my own color version of the characters or something like that. But uh, we're gonna go through it, we're gonna take a look, see what I wanna do, and then we're gonna get started on it. So let's go do that now. All right, so first, I'm gonna go to Google. Open them up. So I don't know, I was thinking like, I wanna do more than one character. I don't want to just do Sonic, I don't think. Like, I want to do, you know? So I'm thinking, like, I don't know, maybe, uh, maybe a Sonic and Shadow piece or something. Oops. Shadow's a pretty dope-ass character, so let's see what we can find. Oh, apparently there's a bunch of YouTube animations. That's pretty funny. Oh, this is a dope picture right here. Not that I'm gonna use this one, but this would be a sick one to do. That's sick, yo. I might actually end up doing that one. Let's see. There's only the first look, so I gotta give it some time here. I can't just rush into it. Gotta find the right picture, you know? It's kinda cool. It's not really full scale, though. I want kind of their whole thing in there. Oh, shit. Look at this one. I've seen this one before actually, I like this one a lot. You know what, I'm gonna hold on to that one. This is one of those ones that you just, oh shit, I clicked the wrong fucking button. Save image as. Sonic and Shadow. All right, let's see what else we got. Oh, this one's pretty dope too. Oh, that's somebody's sketch, ha, huh, that's dope. Is that from DeviantArt? No. No. I always like, I've really always liked to draw Sonic. I used to have, speaking of it, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. I have uh, Sonic Adventure 1 on Xbox 360. I think I might even have number 2 as well on Xbox 360 also, but I used to love drawing him. Like He's one of those characters I can actually sit down and just draw without even looking most of the time, and it turns out fairly decent. You know what, I think, I'm thinking that the one I picked is actually going to be the one, just based on what I'm seeing here, because I like how the chows are in there, it adds more to the picture, you know? Like, these ones are dope, but I'm looking to do something more, more squared, and just with Sonic and Shadow, I'm thinking, I'd like to do this guy in it individually on his own, even, or like, you guys remember that character, uh, what's his name, Big or something? Hang on. This guy. <laughs> remember this guy? This guy's dope. I would like to do this guy, I think, one day. He'd be fun. But anyways, okay, so I think I'm gonna go with that. So, uh, alright, let's get into Photoshop.
All right, so the Sonic piece is done. I am super, super, super happy with this. It looks really dope. I can't complain one bit about how this ended up, and I'm really satisfied with the job I did, and I'm eating vegetables, so I'm a good boy. But yeah, man, I'm, I'm super happy about it. I, I can't complain at all. I think it turned out really dope. The colors I used were really sick. They complemented each other nicely. And I think also, excuse me, that the line work just turned out pretty crisp. It's not perfect. It's really difficult to get like extremely crispy lines with the digital art, but it's, it's good. I'm happy. I'm definitely, uh, I think I'm seeing improvement with the digital art when it comes to the line work and things like that. So I'm really happy. Uh, let's do a final comparison and then I'll show you guys the, the website I updated so you guys can go check that out if you want to. Like I said before in the last video, I'm not trying to promote you guys going to buy anything from me. I don't care if you buy things, it's not a big deal, it's whatever, but I put it up there for the people who are requesting it because a lot of people were requesting it and so now I have a few things up there you can go check out if you want to. There's like blankets and towels and rugs and, and prints, obviously there's prints, but uh, yeah, anyway, I'll just show you. Okay, so let's do a super, super quick comparison of the pictures, and then let's get to that website really fast. I'm trying to take up all the world's time because that's a selfish thing to do and I'm a kind fellow. So, let's see here. Very quickly, open that up. Slide them over, shut you off, slide you over, pick you up, there you go. All right, so you can see the difference in the comparison between the two. I think they both look pretty crisp. I did fuck up on the, uh, the dark towel a little bit, He's very, in comparison, very not as cool. Um, but even still, I mean, I'm very happy with how I did. It's never gonna be perfect, but I think I did a pretty damn great job, and Sonic and Shadow are the main uh, focus of the picture. So yeah, anyway, okay, cool. Solid comparison, now let's go to the website quick. Um, so with this website, basically, you have the ability to, in some instances, only with the prints, the art prints, the canvas prints, and the frame prints do you have the option to choose your pricing and what I mean by that is I can select how much money I want to make um, on top of the money that the company is gonna make so basically the company will ship out the thing to you they put out the like the quality image on whatever you're wanting to buy um, and then I make whatever money I choose on only the prints the t-shirts you make a certain set amount you can't change it uh, the pillows the the hand towels the books the uh, phone cases all the prices for those things, I can't choose them. The only prices I can choose are for the art prints. And so I'll show you exactly in detail really quickly what I mean by that so you guys know I'm not trying to scam anybody because every single thing that I've charged for and chosen the prices of does not go above, I think, $8 or $9. So I'll just click open this guy. Um, let me see here. Okay, so art print, for example. So you see on the side here, an eight by six is five bucks, 13 by nine, five bucks. So everything is basically five or six bucks until it gets really, really large, and then I go $7. And so the reason I did it really cheap like that is because I don't want you guys to think I'm scamming you, because I'm not. I don't really care if I make a lot of money or not, because I'm not, because I don't. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I just want you guys to be able to have access to this as pretty much as cheap as possible while I'm not making, you know, one or two dollars instead. Um, like I could put this down to even a dollar, but that's just really ridiculously cheap. So I'm gonna keep them all at five because that's an even balance between everything. And that's how you know, like, if you get a larger piece, I'm not trying to scam you by saying, oh, I want $29 million more. I just want one or $2 more when it gets really, really large. But for the general census of all the sizes, they still kind of all remain only at $5. So let's just go back really quick and then I'll show you a couple of the different options you can get things in. This one only has prints, I'm pretty sure. Oh no, here we go, so yeah. So there's clocks, there's uh, wall tapestries, there's rugs, uh, pillows. Now just remember, not every picture I've chosen has all these things available. Like you see how the shower curtain is here? I could have turned that on, but I'm not going to because I really don't think people are going to buy a shower curtain of cartoons uh, unless their child has their own bathroom in a big mansion that they own. So if there's rich people out there and you want a shower curtain, let me know, I'll turn it on. But I don't see the need for that right now. Uh, the more options you give, the more confusing it would get for customers. And really, like, I'm just trying to keep it simple, you know what I mean? So there's bath mats, uh, there's travel mugs, there's a notebook. This one has a notebook. I don't think all of the pieces I did have a notebook because some of them looked kind of funny, but I think one or two more of them do. Uh, all these t-shirts and clothing things are off. The backpacks and everything are off because the, the layout comes out really stupid. And yeah, so you guys can see here all the options. Um, as you can see, I'm talking really fast because I'm trying to get through this. 
I'm not going to show you any of the other art. I'll just show you what art is available, which is the cowboy dude, the pirate thing I did, uh, the Facebook prisoner guy. Uh, this cityscape one, I'll show you this because I didn't do a video of this. This was the first ever digital piece I literally ever, ever did. Uh, it was a practice piece. I'll just show you a really large, super quick. And then that's going to be the end of the video. Um, but yeah, so it was a practice piece. It took me like quite a few days and I was just practicing, trying to get all the details in there that I possibly could. And it came out really dope. I should have done a video, but my computer wasn't working for that at the time. So there's that. That's the piece that I was talking about. That you can get as a print if you wanted to as well. The lines are not super crisp on some of these buildings because I was learning. And yeah, but I'm very happy with how it came out for the first ever digital piece other than the panda. So yeah, all right, cool. That's it, that's done. Video's over. Take it easy, have fun. Let me know in the comments if you liked it. Drop a subscribe if you can. Uh, click the like button 59 million times even though it goes on and off, on and off, on and off. Just do it anyway because it's a fun thing to do and go blah, 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 blah while you do it. And we'll see you in the next video.